Hey guys, I'm going to teach you a new way to install Conan Exile mods. Now, I don't have any scripts I'm running, you know, this is purely out of memory and if I slur some words, forgive me. So anyway, without wasting any time, let's go ahead and straight to the point. So lately, uh, Conan Exiles and Xbox Game Pass has changed a few things on their app. It used to be in here, and you can en enable mods. So you, you can't enable mods anymore. Even if you have a second account, which, you know, first account I, I used to buy, and then the second account is to play the games. So, why is that? I, I, I have no idea, because... This is the only game that doesn't support, you know, mod features in, in, in so many weird reasons. I don't know why, but I discovered a alternative way. This way is just awesome. You don't need to do anything like, oh, I need to change this and then, you know, I need to go. Oh, oops. I need to go to do this and then make a new folder. No, <clears throat> all you need to do first is go to Xbox games, Conan Exiles, content, Windows, no editor, and Conan Sandbox. Now, after you, after you go to the directory and you create a folder called mods, so this is my current mods uh, that I use. And now don't be intim intimidated by this long text, string of text. The reason why, you know, it doesn't work, like the old ways, you just use this kind of list. It doesn't work that way anymore. They, they changed it. So what I do is I put like you know there's like asterisk symbol or star symbol and then directory and you have to find an actually a on, go to windows apps oops and you have to find because i didn't i didn't actually you know open this folder yet to test uh to test the mods so if, if you do that you know this directory right here will act like a for example that there's like cmd um commands that you can actually junction directory to another directory you can bind you don't have to do that anymore so you have to just type in this. I will I will put everything on the description and then you guys can put that manually. So no problem on there. <laughs> this is the only way you could install the mods without enabling from the manager right here. So now Someone have asked me on Discord how to disable or uninstall the mods. You simply just get rid, like, for example, if you don't want to use Smaller Body anymore, you have to actually go to the mods folder and then just delete the file physically. You can't simply just disable this I will, I will still enable the mod because the the mod section on conan doesn't appear that way unless you do something like UW, uwp hook to actually fix the the mod so <laughs> that's how i actually did it so UWP hook.
now what this does is to hook or to um, to bind that game on your client now there's cons on this trick this trick doesn't require to do anything else you just hook the game on the steam client and the mod menu will appear automatically without you doing anything really hacky or you know changing stuff on internal folder you don't you don't have to do that anymore so this part of the application which is uw uwp hook is something that you, you know i discovered accidentally while you know i was like hmm how do you bind all this you know all these mods if i don't have the feature now you have new ways first you can add the uh, mods manually and then you can use the uwp uh, binding on steam client so if you enjoy this video don't forget click subscribe notification like all that good stuff and be a legend i will see you guys later